Welcome to Ramesh Kakan's inspiring videos exploring the vision Nilgiris Baduga 2050 initiatives. Nilgiris people and their villages and Nilgiris dance I Atta and culture believe in God, interesting story about trust in God, story to motivate one to always believe in God, story deep understanding about life, reality and ultimate goal, health initiatives and inner consciousness through meditation are vital aspects for Nilgiris residents to take their thoughts to space and star world. How to take your thoughts to stars world. Daily we need to practice meditation starting with few minutes up to one hour by different meditation practice like counting breath, pulse beat, thoughts, people, thinking beyond borders, envisioning all souls in the cosmos. Our thoughts develop to aid nature and ultimate joy in meditation. Today's undiscovered question, what is the difference between prayer and meditation? In Sindhanai Ulagam Baduga community fosters stronger social and cultural bonds. In today's Stodi, have you ever pondered over what faith truly means? How deep must one's belief run to withstand the trials of life? Let's immerse ourselves in a tale that might shed some light on these profound questions. Once upon a time, there lived a poor woman whose belief in the divine was unshakable. She and her family hadn't had a morsel to eat for days. In her desperation, she reached out to God through a radio broadcast, pleading for his divine intervention. In the same city, a wealthy man who did not believe in God happened to hear this broadcast. A spark of mischief ignited within him, and he decided to challenge the woman's faith. He instructed his secretary to purchase a month's worth of food and deliver it to the poor woman's home, with a message that the provisions were not from God, but from the devil. The secretary, following his employer's orders, did as he was told. Upon reaching the woman's house, he handed over the food. The woman began to stow away the food without uttering a word of inquiry. This puzzled the secretary who anticipated her question regarding the source of the food. Unable to contain his curiosity, the secretary asked, Aren't you going to ask who sent this food? The woman, without missing a beat, responded, I know it's sent by God. The secretary, taken aback, corrected her. No, it was not sent by God. It was sent by the devil. The woman continued her work in silence, prompting the secretary to repeat his revelation. Are you not surprised to know that it was the devil who sent this? The woman with a peaceful smile replied, What's surprising about that? When God gives an order, even the devil has to follow. This story, while simple, carries a profound message about faith and belief. It shows us that faith is not just about acknowledging the existence of a higher power. It's about an unwavering trust that the universe, in all its divine orchestration, is working in our favor, even in the most challenging times. It's about knowing that even when the devil knocks on our doors, it's with God's permission. So believe, not because it's easy, but because faith can make the impossible, possible. Answering today's undiscovered question, prayer is asking God for some favors. Meditation means merging the thoughts with nature's rhythm. In conclusion, Ramesh Kakan F. Tamulagor village in Nilgiris in India, expresses gratitude and appeal our people to move forward in our mission. Thank you for your support in spreading awareness and building a community dedicated to the next level of positive change in thought process.